Happy Chicken Day, everybody. Oh. Or whatever this is. Aw, now Chicky can finally live up to his ancestors and look just adorable while doing it. <laughs> what a cute little nugget. In fact, it looks like all the animals are having a costume party today. Oh. A dog dryer. Let's hope today's toys are all about our furry friends. But first, let's make sure it actually works. Thank goodness we already have a wet puppy. What a good girl, staying calm while putting something on her. Let's hope she stays nice when the dryer turns on. Well, if you ever wanted a puppy puppy, here you go. Wow, it works. And while you're here, why don't you subscribe? Anything that makes balloon dogs is worth its weight in gold. A dog umbrella? Wait, how is she going to be able to hold that handle? Something tells me that chain is going to answer that. Right, the hook keeps the umbrella close by while you hold it. Good thing, too. It looks like a real storm out there. And there's even room for two. But the important thing is that the dog's okay. I guess this is a tool that you and your furry friend can share. Yeah, relax those smile muscles. Seriously, she smiles way too much. But let's try it out on your cat. Wow, he seems to like it. You've got yourself a real Cheshire cat here, don't you? I wonder if it works on pets other than cats. Let's see. This thing seems to be a real crowd pleaser, doesn't it? From this angle, this thing almost looks like a face. With this pouch, now you can always keep your best buddy close by. After all, why should kangaroos have all the fun? They've had it good for too long. Make sure to zip everything up. How on earth did she get that jacket on underneath? Aww, now you can take your dog on bike rides through the park? Keep them close while doing your laundry and other chores. And even introduce them to various babies. I mean, you probably can do that without a pouch, but where's the fun in that? That lady's just jealous that you have a cuter baby. What makes this cat toy more interactive than regular cat toys? Well, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Oh, wow! Huh. It moves on its own. All the fun of playing with your cat without actually playing with your cat. Hmm. Or the fun. Yeah, in other words, some cats just have good taste. I wonder if we're gonna see anything for that baby chick. A duck muzzle? For your dog? I guess that's close enough. Okay, I see. This way your pupper doesn't sneak snacks without you knowing. Especially any suspicious breadcrumbs. Yeah, that's right, I read Hansel and Gretel. And your puppy's already got a Halloween costume, too. Of course, dog care is a little more than just fun and games. Being a responsible pet owner can be real dirty work. In other words, honey, that's not a purse. Oh, well, get your bag ready. It's time for a walk. Oh man, I don't want to know what you've been feeding this dog. Good idea, use the tool. You don't know where this toy's been. And you can throw it away without getting your hands dirty. Hey, don't tell me what I can and can't use for a purse. Well, whatever this is, I'm having flashbacks to my pet hedgehog. Which is weird considering I've never had a pet hedgehog. Aside from Sonic, that is. Either way, it's a paw cleaner, and it looks like you need to put it together. Complete with some water and a lid. Make it tight. And it looks like we already have some dirty paws to try it on. She's caught red-handed. Or maybe uh, brownish gray-handed. Three, two, one, success! Her paw is nice and clean. But don't forget, she's got four paws. Make sure to really get in there. And we've also got a nifty tool for cleaning those paw prints on the floor. A mop. 
This thing looks like a gadget from an old-timey sci-fi movie. Please tell me you're not feeding candies to your dog. Okay, good idea. Try it for yourself before testing it on your dog. I mean, I wouldn't want something happening to the dog. Good thing your dog's such a good girl. It's always time for a treat. Wow, that's a good catch. Can she do it a second time? Yes! Third time's a charm. Make that fourth. Good girl. No one cares about the fifth. That'd just be excessive. Yeah, a dog deserves a nice treat after a good workout. What's this? Oh, it's a brush for doggy bath time. Only now, we just need a magic tool to get your dog in the tub. Oh, that's clever. You even get to sneak in the soap. And every second counts once your puppy hits the water. Wow, either you have the most well-behaved dog on earth, or your pet fish is in serious need of a haircut. But seriously, how do you do it? Extra walk, double kibble? Don't forget the towel. We don't want her to shake herself dry. Although I'm surprised such a good girl doesn't towel herself off. If only everybody else was so easy to train. By the way, who gets to tell them that's the dogs? Hmm. What's next? A tennis ball? <laughs> Come on, that's an old classic. Now that's more like it. Adding a techno twist. <laughs> oh, uh, not that kind of techno. Either way, she seems to be having a good time. If only they made something that puts the balls in for you. Cool. With this next tool, we get to play doggy dentist. By the way, have you subscribed already? Come on, even your dog wants you to do that. Hey, bad girl, that's the dogs. I really need to keep an eye on her. That's better. And by the looks of things, or rather, the smell. We've picked the right time to try it out. If only she'd open her mouth. Don't forget to hold her still. I should have spoke sooner. There's a reason they invented dental chews. Those toys were doggone awesome. Catch you next time. Thank you.